Hi guys, and welcome back to my kitchen table and another one of my mocks. Today, I'm bringing you something quite out of the ordinary. For once, I have made a mock not Star Wars oriented. And this is a Lego Batman mock. I got inspired to build this by me re-watching the Lego Batman movie once more. And I thought I would build this. The streets of Gotham. The only part of this mock not completely built by me is the car over here. That is a Lego IDS promo that I got a while back uh, when I ordered some new pieces. But let's get right into the mock. This main area kind of got the road running around here. We have two Gotham police officers holding the Joker at gunpoint in his kind of clown car over here. So I thought this like light blue car would really fit the Joker uh, and his color scheme. <laughs> then along the streets, we've got the sidewalk. We've got a lamp post, kind of like an old timey rubbish bin. We've got a mailbox and a fire post. Along the house, I have used a lot of snot technique to get this kind of exterior. And we've got some windows. It's a red part of the building. With the bricks that extends up to a more like modern part of the building. And Batman is looking down, ready to strike the Joker and arrest him. On top of the roof, we've got these kind of antennas and this kind of AC up here on the roof. Some more like real old timey TV antennas and one of those TV antenna dishes as well. We've got these chimneys with some smoke popping out of the top of it. I'm trying to get focus there. Like that. We've got this balcony here with a door that is merely cosmetical. It does not open, but it gives kind of a nice feel to it. Got this fire escape ladder running down towards the street. Then we got this little flower here in the window. I had some old doors I thought could work in unison towards this whole mark. They do open and close. I got kind of a fun idea here on the back. I have made full, like, this is kind of like a collab because it's more of a Lego City mock here in the back where I built this kind of dollhouse effect. We can see into the whole building from the back. You can also slide out individual apartments, which I thought worked out pretty cool. So this is my favorite one, so I'll start with this one. You can just slide it out like this. Then inside of the apartment, we've got a small kitchen, stove, and a uh, sink. Got a lamp. Got this little cupboard over here. A glass of wine for someone. And a little stool to sit on. Got this really cozy bed here. Then a flower in the corner. Have as well got a toilet with a mirror, a sink, a little toilet and some toilet paper. So it's a kind of like two or three separate rooms in this apartment. Uh, however you want to see it. Okay, so we just slide that back in. On the top floor, <clears throat> we got this kind of more of a living room style apartment with a computer, with a nice swiveling chair, computer screen. Got our Lego City fellow here. Sitting in his sofa, having a good 
old drink. And he's got his coffee table here. We've got a rug. And then a small bookcase with a lamp in it. We've got one of these old timey vinyl players in the apartment. Then we just slide this all back in like that. On the first floor, we've got this little pool table section here. People to play pool. Built this pool table then. And please don't complain about this, but well, my girlfriend gave a go at building a sofa in Lego, so you can blame her for this design. But I guess it's kind of futuristic and artistic. Got this floorboards here, and then a the fireplace you can really coast up in front of. Like that. Then we've also got kind of a meeting room here, a little conference room with a table, some kind of table lamp, little painting here on the wall, and a plant in the corner. Yeah. So I kind of combined these two idea, two ideas, sorry, with having one house and a Batman mock on the front of it. Then getting kind of creative with building a kind of Lego City apartment complex on the back. So yeah, there's two sides to this mock. Go over the details. I just had some old Lego City police officers like replace the faces with to get the skin color right. And here's the overview of it all. Well, this is just kind of like a fun side project I made. I do hope you guys enjoy this. And if you did, do leave a like, comment, and why not subscribe? I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. Bye.